Why did it flood so badly in western North Carolina? Some scientists point to this weather effect. Asheville Citizen Times Western NC saw several inches of rain when tropical storm Helena barreled through. But what caused it to rain so much? What some scientists think? Below are your comments. Need to keep in mind that much of this area got around six of rain a few days before the hurricane. Zero, zero. The ground was saturated. When you look at a map outlining the Blue Ridge Mountains and look at a map of rainfall amounts, flow. D events there's a strong correlation. Those rain clouds were lifted up by topography and dropped their rain. You see this effect in many places. Additionally you should note all those homes were built on a flat place next to the rivers and creek. S. These are floodplains. It's much more expensive to build on a slope but safer. I live in WNC. When you see the damage up close it's hard to comprehend. When you see videos of how fast this huge amount of water was moving, you can understand why our riv. Our banks look like they've been scoured. Everything near the water had no chance of surviving. It not only washed out local community bridges, but an interstate bridge in Tien. Members of our community are still stunned, days after the event. People built homes and businesses on flat-bottom land next to streams and creeks, which the Storm D. determined to be a flood zone. This happens all across our country, and flooding has occurred here in the past but they rebuild in the same place. Maybe places built in areas that funnel water are too low and near rivers. Please subscribe to my channel. And if you like it, please thumbs up.